I was going in for my ultrasound to find out the sex of the baby, and um, they had found out one of my tests that came out uh, positive, my blood test. So then they sent me here to find out more about the defect. As part of a prenatal testing, you do what's called a quad screen. And the quad screen actually will look to see if your baby's at risk for having a hole in the spine. And it just so happens that her quad screen back, back is positive. Spina bifida is a failure of the closure of the back, particularly of both the spine and the spinal cord in the first month after the baby is being developed. It leads to a defect in the back and the spinal elements that actually stick out of the back, often in a sac, that can be non-functional. And that can lead to problems with movement of the limbs below that level of, of impairment. It can involve sensation impairment below the level. And there's also an association with hydrocephalus or fluid in the brain that accumulates due to that abnormality. Back in 1997 was the, the first procedure where they actually were, where someone took the chance of saying, let's open up the uterus, let's close this defect, and let's see if we can't keep these, these outcomes from happening, or can we make better outcomes? Me and Dr. Bowie had got together and said, listen, this is something that we need to offer in the region. I think we have enough volume of these babies that we see in my clinic to make this a technique that we can offer here at Ostern. So we're able to actually have a window up in the uterus and then be able to bring just the baby's back through. So once we're able to get to the defect, then uh, the night take over, and under high magnification, we actually do the repair. This is one of those instances where you really are making a difference for the patient. And over the years, there have been some of those in adults and some of those in children, and this is one that is really gonna be a great advance for children. Now that he's here and we've gone through everything, I'm very, very happy that we went ahead and did it because his outcome does look a lot better than what it would have been if we didn't do the surgery. That's what makes it worth it, is the ability to really change one's kid's whole entire life with an operation early on.